It's time to get right with God. That's my message. But my calling this morning is a watchman. And I'm telling you now what I believe the Holy Spirit is saying. It's time to get right with God. To those, O oh Lord, who have been growing cold and indifferent to the call of God and the things of Christ. I don't know who this is for. But Lord, I'm going to speak to those who know their sinners, to those who have backslidden. Do not harden your heart. And he said, that's what Israel did and that is what many have done all these times. And the Lord says in the last day, he said, the door is still open. Don't you harden your heart. Israel hardened their heart, the Bible says, in the day of provocation, in a time when they believed that God no longer answered their prayers, in a time of deep affliction, in a time of trouble, the Bible says they hardened their heart because they couldn't see any evidence of God answering their prayer. I hear people say, I can get right with God any time I choose. I'll know the time. I'm not ready yet, and I'll know the time. I, I have some things I want to accomplish in my life, and I have friends, and I want to enjoy myself. And when I'm, when I'm ready, I'll come to God. Now, there's some problems with that. And there are issues that you've got to understand because coldness leads to hardness. That's what the Scripture says. He said, there will come a great falling away. And those who receive not the truth are going to fall under what the Scripture calls the deceivableness of sin. And the Scripture says, take th those who receive not the love of the truth will fall into the deceivableness of sin. There is no God that's party. There's no God have fun. We've come from that. Jesus loves you.